Picture this. You wake up from your sleep, seemingly conscious and alert, but something feels uncanny. You can't move or speak, and you feel something pressing down on your chest. You try calling for help, visioning yourself screaming and shouting, but in reality, you can't move a finger. This is commonly referred to as sleep paralysis, and although much about it remains a mystery, we do have a basic understanding of how it unfolds. During the REM stage, the deepest stage of sleep, our brains toggle off our sense of consciousness and activate REM atonia, a temporary period of muscle inactivity. REM atonia serves as a safety mechanism to prevent us from physically acting out our dreams. Sleep paralysis happens if we unexpectedly gain consciousness at the beginning or end of REM sleep when REM atonia is still in effect. This results in our brain being awake while our bodies are not. We might even hallucinate, be it in feeling as if we're suffocating, imagining the presence of an intruder in our midst, or even feeling as if we're having something akin to an out-of-body experience. So what can we do to prevent it? Although there is a lot to be discovered about the phenomenon, scientists recommend not laying on our backs to avoid disturbing our oxygen intake, as well as adopting a stable sleep schedule to ensure smooth transitions between phases of sleep.